20 years ago, I wrote a book called Tapping the Power Within. Yeah. Tapping the Power Within was 20 on May, April 20th of this year. And anybody that's ever written a book or desires to write a book, write a book, it's like delivering a child. The labor is arduous and the pains come and you can't get out. Now you committed, you in it, you in it, you doing it. So I wrote my wonderful little tap in the power within and uh, I Xeroxed it at Kinko's and I sold it out the trunk of my car. And after two years, because I had a vision that tapping the power within was gonna be great. After two years, I got an offer from a publisher to publish it, and they did. They published Tapping the Power Within. If you have a tapping, you may have one of the six original versions. <laughs> the blue one, the purple one. So finally, it, it was published. And I just thought it was the greatest book since Moby Dick. But I wasn't evaluating the greatness of the book from within me. I was evaluating the greatness of the book by the external response. Let me tell you something, that'll kill you. Never judge the truth that you know or feel based on how other people are responding to it. Can you hear me? You don't need external validation. Don't judge the truth that you know and feel based on how other people are responding to it because they may be looking with a limited vision.